Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. Today in this video we are going to see how to make this beautiful doily pattern. So this doily measures about, you can see 13 inches which is a 33 centimeter. And for making this doily I have used this yarn which is 8 ply acrylic yarn. You can see and crochet hook I have used a size 6 which is a 3.5 millimeter crochet hook. So this is a very simple project. So let's get started. First we are going to make a magic circle. Then we are going to chain 1 and work 12 single crochets in the magic circle. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 and 12. So now we have 12 single crochets. I'm going to pull this yarn tail and close the circle. So here you can see we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Then we are going to work a slip stitch on top of this first single crochet and finish this round. So first round is done. For the next round we are going to chain 3 which counts as a double crochet. Then we will chain 2 and work 1 double crochet into the next stitch. Then chain 2 double crochet into the next stitch. Then chain 2 double crochet into the next stitch chain 2 and double crochet into the next stitch chain 2 double crochet into the next stitch chain 2 and double crochet into the next stitch Chain 2, so like this we are going to continue and finish this round. So here I am at the end of this round, I have made a double crochet. Now I am going to chain 2, make a slip stitch on top of the first chain 3, 1, 2, 3. Here I am going to make a slip stitch and finish this round. So our second round is done. So for the next round chain 3 which counts as a double crochet then work another double crochet into the same stitch. So we have made an increase in this stitch that means we have 2 double crochets including the chain 3. Then chain 2 and work 2 double crochets into the next stitch. So 1 and 2 then chain 2 Again, 2 double crochets that is increase into the next stitch. 1 and 2. Then chain 2, chain 2 again, 2 double crochets into the next stitch. 1 and 2. So like this we are going to repeat around and finish this round in here. So here you can see I have finished this round. For the next round chain 3. Then double crochet into the same stitch. That is we have 2 double crochets in the first stitch. 
then we will work one double crochet into the next stitch so one then we will chain two and work two double crochets in the first stitch one two then work one double crochet into the next stitch then chain two increase in the first stitch that is two double crochets one two then one double crochet in the next stitch chain two again two double crochets in the first stitch one two then one double crochet in the next stitch so like this we are going to continue this round and finish this here so here you can see I have finished this round by making a slip stitch on top of the first chain 3 so for the next round chain 3 again one double crochet into the same stitch so double crochet into the same stitch where we made the chain 3 so here double crochet then work one double crochet into the next two stitches so one and two then chain two again increase in the first stitch so one and two in the same stitch then one double crochet into the next two stitches one and two then chain two increase in the first stitch one two then one double crochet into the next two stitches one and two then chain two increase in the first stitch one two then one double crochet in the next two stitches one and two so like this we are going to continue around and finish this round so here you can see i have finished this round for the next round chain three double crochet into the same stitch which is the increase then we will work one double crochet into the next three stitches so one two and three then chain two increase in the first stitch so one and two in the same stitch then we will work these three double crochets one two and three then chain two increase in the first stitch one and two in the same stitch then we will work the three double crochets one two and three so like this we are going to continue this round and finish here so here you can see I have finished this round for the next round chain three and double crochet into the same stitch then we will work one double crochet into the next four stitches so one two three so three and four so four then chain two then again increase in the first stitch 
1 and 2 into the same stitch then 4 double crochets 1 then 2 3 and 4 so like this we are going to repeat around and finish this round so here I have finished this round for the next round chain 3 1 2 3 double crochet into the same stitch then we will work 1 double crochet into the next 5 stitches so 1 2 then 3 4 and 5 then chain 2 increase in the first stitch that is 2 double crochets in the first stitch 1 2 then we will work 5 double crochets 1 2 then 3 3 4 and 5 so like this we are going to repeat around and finish this round so here I have finished this round the next round chain 3 and double crochet into the same stitch which is a increase then work 6 double crochets 1 2 then 3 4 5 and 6 then we will chain 2 increase in the first stitch so 1 and 2 in the same stitch then we will work 6 double crochets 1 2 3 4 5 6 then chain 2 we will repeat the same so we will continue and finish this round so here we have finished this round for the next round chain 3 1 2 3 and double crochet in the same stitch then we will work 7 double crochets so 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 then we will chain 3 1 2 3 then again we will do the same increase in the first stitch 1 and 2 in the same stitch then we will work 7 double crochets 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 then chain 3 and we will repeat the same and finish this round in here so here I have finished this round for the next round I am going to slip stitch into the next stitch and start it from there so I am going to chain 3 
and work double crochet into the next six stitches so 1 2 3 4 5 and 6 then we are going to skip this last stitch so we have 7 double crochets then we will chain 2 and work a double crochet into the center chain that is the second chain 1 and 2 so into the second chain we are going to work a double crochet then we will chain 3 1 2 3 and work another double crochet into the same stitch so here we will work another double crochet then we will chain 2 and we will skip the first and last stitch and work 7 double crochets in between so 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 skip the last stitch chain 2 and work a double crochet into the second chain so I will work a double crochet then chain 3 work another double crochet into the same chain then chain 2 we will again skip the first and last stitch and work 7 double crochets in between so 1 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 so like this we are going to repeat this round same pattern and finish this round in here so here you can see I have finished this round for the next round I am going to slip stitch into the next stitch and start from there so make a slip stitch into the next stitch then we will chain 3 which counts as a double crochet work 1 double crochet into the next 4 stitches so 1 2 3 and 4 then we will skip the last stitch chain 3 and work 5 double crochets into this chain 3 space so here we will work 5 double crochets 1 2 3 4 and 5 then we will chain 3 again 1 2 3 we will skip the first and last stitch and work the middle 5 stitches so double crochet 1 2 3 4 5 then we will chain 3 again 1 2 3 skip the first sorry here we will work 5 double crochets 1 2 3 4 5 so 5 double crochets then chain 3 skip the first and last stitch and work 5 double crochet in between so 1 
two, three, four, and five. So like this, we are going to continue this round and finish this in here. So here you can see I have finished this round. Then for the next round, I'm going to slip stitch into the next stitch and start the next round from here. Chain three and double crochet into the next two stitches. So one and two. Then we will chain three and work one double crochet on top of this first double crochet. So one double crochet then chain two then double crochet in the next stitch then again chain two double crochet in the next stitch here then chain two then double crochet into the next stitch chain two then double crochet into the next stitch so here you can see we have five double crochets with chain two space then we are going to chain three one two three skip the first and last stitch and work the center three double crochets so one then two and three then we will chain three again double crochet skip the last stitch then double crochet on top of this first double crochet chain two double crochet into the next stitch chain two double crochet in the next stitch chain two then double crochet in the next stitch chain 2 then double crochet in the next stitch then we will chain 3 skip the first and last stitch and work the center 3 double crochet 1 2 and 3 so like this we are going to repeat this round around and finish this round so here you can see I have finished this round so for the next round which is the last round I am going to make a single crochet into the next stitch single crochet then here we will chain 2 so chain 2 so not chain 4 here I have mistakenly did chain 4 it is chain 2 then make a double crochet on top of the first double crochet then we will chain 3 and make a picot stitch by making a single crochet into these two side loops so make a single crochet that's our picot and work another double crochet into the same stitch then double crochet into the next stitch then picot chain 3 and single crochet into these two side loops then double crochet into the same stitch then double crochet into the next stitch then chain 3 1 2 3 picot by making a single crochet into these two side loops then work another double crochet into the same stitch then double crochet in the next stitch chain 3 single crochet into these two side loops and make a picot then double crochet into the same stitch 
then double crochet into the next stitch chain 3 make a picot and double crochet into the same stitch so here you can see our 5 picot stitches then chain 2 2 then we will make a single crochet into this second that is the center stitch so here we will make a single crochet then chain 2 again 1 2 and we will repeat the same double crochet in the first stitch chain 3 and picot then again double crochet into the same stitch so like this we are going to repeat on every double crochet and finish this round in here so here I am at the end of this round I am going to I have made chain 2 going to make a slip stitch on top of this first single crochet and finish this round so chain 1 cut off the yarn and pull the yarn through now I am going to hide all these yarn tails with a tapestry needle so a beautiful doily pattern is now ready I hope you guys like this video tutorial so hit the like button leave a comment below share with your friends and subscribe to my channel for more videos thank you guys bye bye